Hey guys, Old Jack Burton here again, playing Crusader Kings 2, a Game of Thrones modification, version 4.3 this time. Uh, so we're going to dive straight in after our fairly short um, Donishman's Wife tale with Lord Trevor the Incapable. Um, and we're going to go ahead, I was debating doing Feast for Crows, um, but I think for the sake of this we'll do... In fact, no, let's go ahead and do Feast for Crows, I'll tell you why in a moment. Because rather than pick one of the large houses, I'm going to go ahead and pick this little island here. And that's Seri. Now you might, rem you might remember in the books, uh, the, island the Iron Islands under Euron go ahead and they try and sack pretty much half of the reach here. Now the first thing they do sack are these four islands here. So we're going to jump into the game and see whereabouts we're up to. Hopefully there won't be any ironborn nearby so far. Gives me a bit of a time to uh, get my defences ready. So here we go. Just ignore the fact it's going really slow. I'm rendering right now. Right here we go. Let's play with a normal summer. Oh! That's a nice start. The ironborn are already on my island. Ah, oh, Talbot, my son, he's already died. So if you've read the books at all, there is a great battle in which the Iron Islands start invading the Shield Islands. The Shield Islands get whatever ships they can, they make out here. This guy here, Talbot Seri, has an epic battle with Victorian Greyjoy on the bow of his ship. Victorian is obviously, he wins that battle. Seri falls over the side in his full armour and is believed to have been dead and drowned into the sea. However, Victorian is actually wounded during this and it actually hurts his hand, which later on something quite interesting happens with. But I won't spoil it for people who haven't uh, read it too much. Alright, let's see what happens here. There's not too much I can do until we uh, play a career. A career. Go to you. God, I'm tired. Okay, I'm just quickly checking out to see if there's any actually uh, new updates I can see straight away. Oh, this appears exactly the same. Let's have a look at some ambitions. Oh, I do have a little s oh, grandson. It's my heir. Uh, so far, nothing looks too different here. Well, let's go straight in and see what happens here. Now the good news is, it looks like they're leaving. We had commands happen to us, well that's uh, always good. Let's go ahead and pick an ambition. Not much that I can actually do here. I don't want plot. Where's my ambitions gone? Okay. Gosh, she's a bit old and haggard. Oh, that's new. I'll take the Valerian sword. Unfortunately, I don't think it's going to happen. So we're not satisfied with the size of our lands. We're going to try and increase that a little bit. Need these ironborn to bugger off first. So they've taken South Castle. Here to have left our cities alone. We've got no one at all. So this is going to make for a challenging Let's Play series. 
Uh, for those of you who watched the last one, it was a very short series. This hopefully will not be. Um, obviously, I will carry on until the family are, you know, where I want them to be. And this is going to be the first in. some factions. This is going to be the first in a set of videos that I'm going to have. Obviously we're going to have this Seri series. Um, I'll come up for a name for that later. We're also going to do some other um, factions. We're going to do one from the Starks, one from the Arons, and possibly one from the Lannisters. And I'll be uploading these in order, pretty much. At least an episode a week, if not more. Right, so they've left two of the Shield Islands. While this is going on, let's try and get a claim somewhere. Hey, this is Sarah. She's got a husband's little kids. Right, so I'm going to try and go for Green Shield. That's a new thing as well, improve castle holding. The heir has no husband. Range of betrothal. Oh, what have done? Where's my grandson gone? Oh, he's over with Mace Terrell, that's why. Alright, lads, well, you stay there then. I'll have to sort that later. You can see there's a massive Tyrell army up here, or Tyrell, however you want to say it. Um, hopefully they'll start coming back down to take care of these guys who are decimating these islands. Meanwhile... <sighs> now I don't see much point in trying to take back the castle just yet, because obviously I don't have the men there and these guys will come over straight away. Who have they left alive here? Okay, so they've got a full family. Speed it up a little bit, see what happens. Here they come to save the day. Oh, do they? Where are they going? Put it down to two speed now. These guys are going to come on over, hopefully uh, eradicate the invasion. It's going to kick off, so let's slow it down. So far, so good. Ah, they've picked a terrible side to try and do it on. They're getting a negative modifier here. They should have enough men to take care of them, hopefully. And then we can start rebuilding. Here we go. So there's 5,000 of them left. Hopefully these guys will chase them. Like the, this is my island. This is my other. Oh, there we go. See, the mere thought of me about to sing prompted these guys to run and start a bloody battle. The peasants told the whole castle about a dragon they saw in the forest, and now the eager young man keep nagging me about a true dragon hunt. I don't want to. No. I'll try. 
couple of imprisonments, nothing special. Oh, that's right, come over to my island. Come on, where are you going? This should be the last of them now, unless there's reinforcements on the way. Don't see any ships. Perfect, thank you very much. Seventeen of them. Look at that, let's take them out. This one's for Talbot. God damn it, Talbot. Why did you have to drown like that? Allegedly. Okay. So we have survived the invasion of uh, the Iron Bomb. Time to rebuild and form a strategy, find out what it is we're going to do. So my immediate plan is to obviously get a claim on this island, try and take that. Um, we do have some independence here. Worthwhile, we ain't gonna have the men to take it. Possibly, we'll see what happens. Let's get a good overview of the map. Ah, oh, great. <laughs> My plan's just gone to bugger it because this guy's apparently died and now Mace has it. So, um,. Their proposal. Let's get my guy over here to try and uh, get some claims on Norcross. And um, we'll stick with a fairly similar format to what we're used to. We'll be doing about 15 minute videos for uh, one part. And obviously, after the issues I had last time with save games, I'm going to make sure I save everything. Why would they want to insult him? He just saved me. No. Or even get me a claim bio. The summer islands invade. Many leagues south of dawn in the summer sea lie the summer islands. The natives of this land are ebony skinned people who wear feathered capes and many bright colours and engage in debauched primitive rituals. It now appears they've united under one king and have an invasion army ready to land on the coast of Salt Shore. Hmm. That's quite good. I uh, can't quite remember where Salt Shore is. There it is. Well, good luck to you. I'm sure you'll be uh, knackered. Taxes collected, get some extra money. Speaking of taxes, let's stick that to small. See, the problem I've got is he's a Terrell. She's a Sari. I need a Sari. my wife I'm 52 years old so I need to uh need to get the ball rolling with this I'm sorry my love 
You're just too bloody old. Uh, one more should do it. Okay, that's both of them joined now, so we just have to wait for an opportunity to see a dead. Hundred two percent plot power, fantastic. I don't think anyone else would join us. Try some pleasures. Now rather than try and bribe someone else to join the plot, I'm just going to buy my time because I've only got 35 gold. It would take the majority of my uh, my wealth to try and convert someone else I think. So let's see what happens at 102%. All we can do really is wait. Meanwhile, the Summer Island invasion has happened. They've taken over two of them. Not very good. Uh, Dawn might have to rally and finally fight. Meanwhile, the crown lands are all appears divided as hell. King Tommen still sits on the throne. Cersei's obviously over here because uh, Tywin is no longer with us. That needs to hurry up here. So obviously this is one of the uh, downsides about playing the smaller faction so to speak is it's a lot of a waiting game it's very strategic you have to put all of your efforts into well you have to be 100% with your decisions pretty much um, now obviously I've got a succession problem as well which I can clearly see that my air uh, Yeah, he says he's a Seri. Why did I say he wasn't a Seri? Oh, they're both Seris. What was I talking about? I think I got confused. It's easily done. So, secession crisis averted. Looks like everything's going to go to my grandson, unless I can actually, uh, kill my wife. Okay, I think here's as good a place as any to stop. Um, thanks for watching and tune in for part two.